Hey YouTube, this is NTU and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to save your SHS2 blobs for iOS 10.2. We know there's already a jailbreak for iOS 10.1.1 which is in beta stages and the developer himself is saying we should save our iOS 10.2 blobs for future restore. Uh, maybe there's a job before I was 10.2 in the corner, so let's just listen to him. But today I'm going to be showing you guys how easily you can do this. All you need is two applications, that is Telegram and BMSSM. Um, in some cases, you wouldn't need um, the BMSSM, that's if you're using iPhone 6 or iPhone 6 Plus. Um, so what you need to do is to go to this website. I'm going to leave the link in the description. And what you have to do is to click on send message then you open it from telegram then you get this start button here so all you need to do is click the start button then you type in um, forward slash then it brings up the sub menu then you click on uh, download SHS blob obviously that's what you want so it's gonna ask you your device version or the device you want to download the blobs for and in this case I'm gonna download the block for my iPhone 6 plus then it's gonna ask you for the device version I mean the iOS version and obviously it's iOS 10.2 that's been signed now so I'll click on iOS 10.2 and then it will ask you for your ECID number and to get your ECID number you need to plug your phone into your computer open iTunes and then double click on your serial number then you're gonna get your ECID number in this case I've, I've already done that and copied it so I'm gonna paste it here and then send it then that's it guys that's how easily you can do this and it's gonna give you your SHS blobs and then also um, a link to where you can download it on your computer but in this case I'm just gonna download it here and you see it's got a verify button over here so you can just check if you've got all the files in there as well so in this case I'm just gonna download it and before I forget I'm just gonna show you why you would need um, the BMSSM if you're using iPhone um, 6 plus or the newer ver versions of the iPhone it's gonna show you your model number and in this case because I was using my iPhone 6 plus it didn't ask me for my model number but if you're using 6s to the newest version then it's going to ask you for your model number. You can see my model number right there. So that's it, guys. This is how easy, very, very easy where you can save your uh, messages to blocks for um, iOS 10.2. So I'll see you guys later, guys. Catch you in another video. Peace out.